What's up, everybody? It is the train, mother and lame, my randies and brandies and tandies and dandies. It's been a while uh, since the last layout update. I have been working on it, just been doing a lot of other things. So I figured I would uh, hop in here for a second and uh, give you a little uh, update on things. It's come along quite nicely. Got our little uh, C420 here, Erie Mining Co. paint. Um, if I can get to focus with my uh, Bachman N Scale Silver Series Allegheny Refining Co. A couple Pennsylvania loads on there. Nice looking train. Um, I guess to start, um, I'm really uh, confident now in uh, the use of quality products and uh, quality rolling stock. Um, definitely NMRA profile wheels and couplers. Um, literally took the amount of derails and mishaps down by like 90%. Um, same thing with my switches. I relayed down the yard, most of it, for uh, like the 15th time uh, with all Pico, Electro Frog, hand snaps. Uh, have had virtually zero problems with those. Um, and for my yard slash industries, I wanted uh, isolated tracks and uh, obviously hand control because I'm not... Um, doing feeder wires I'm not doing anything at all I have my easy command I'm just using this to power it now um, my easy command DCC will more than power this and the uh, planned expansion so um, took out pretty much everything that was here there's not gonna be an industry here made the uh, mine lead come in now so this will be nice and filled in uh, the lead will come in and then you know we got a uh, storage track auxiliary tracks that'll go up here um, into the little feeder zone you got these guys here um, I'm ki currently kit bashing some combination of these um, it used to kind of fill this all in more but I'm gonna leave it more open and have more scenic like more actual coal and this and that around here I'm also filled in the profile of the mining valley as well um, so you can see now it's literally in like its own little world kind of thing um, got to do a lot of work back here and I got this um, one more track I'm probably gonna put a dual split that'll go in here and this will all be and everything else will be, you know, just the actual scene. Um, then, you know, I'm going to do some more of this wall staining and all that good stuff over here. So, coming along, um, like I said, I ripped up. This was going to ignore all this. This is all coal stuff that's going in here somewhere. But um, this used to be, used to have leads coming off here as well uh, to a wood mill. I'm going to save the wood mill and refinery for the expansion down here. Have them both be off a little town scene coming off this way. Um, and over here, we had already planned the pond, uh, started working towards that. Um, this is all going to be the pond scene and filled in with more mountains. So you'll have the main lines, the inner main line running, you know, coming through the tunnel back around the inner main line. And then you got the outer main line. I put in a uh, S switch here, so the outer main line comes, goes through the tunnel. We'll obviously be hidden behind here. We're going to have a little waterfall scene, all the falsetto we've built up more. So the outer main line goes around, back behind here, and then underneath the trestle. And then the third main line will come off here somewhere, go up, probably be hidden, I'm not sure yet. Come across here, gonna put in the little creek valley that's gonna flow into the big pond lake scene. Um, and then it'll follow along the back of there into the 90 tunnel, across the bridge, onto the expansion, and then back. So it's come together quite nicely from the original plan. It's a lot tidier and same kind of idea, just less clunky, more. There's going to be a lot more space and it's going to flow a lot better. It's not going to be heaping track here. This, I really like how when you get down here now, obviously it's still very rough, but you know, you've got your contours, comes into the little valley. And obviously it's all going to be, you know, a couple more tracks up in here, get that going and then, you know, detail. Uh, same over here, just got to kind of finish off the zone. I'm going to do the table probably October, the expansion, so I can get all this side more into it. Finish up the mountain, add some falsettos. Um, and then I got the pond that we're going to do here. We'll have a road that services the mine. Probably have a dead end somewhere. A lot of uh, tall grass. We're going to do shallows and cattails and a very big scene, but with nothing really around it except land. So this is, like I said, all going to be nice and uh, filled in. Um, like I said, though, quality track. I relayed the yard down um, with an actual pre-designed plan this time. Glued it all down. It's bulletproof. 
uh, the Pico switches, quality product, worth a few bucks more, and good track lay. Um, literally zero problems. Um, I also bought brand new Bachman Easy Track switches, and actually am running the power now. I'm going to wire them all to my DCC once uh, we're you know further along. Um, just for right now, they're set up like this. Um, but the powered switches with the Bachman track. Um, like I said, I wanted the hand switches for the yards and industries, but for the main lines, I really wanted powered switches. I had old used Bachman switches that I bought a long time ago. They weren't cared for, they weren't working. Um, everything right now is uh, you know, completely powered and ready to go. So um, again, too, with the wheels and the couplers, just quality stuff. You know, I have a, a ton of rolling stock that don't have, you know, plastic wheels, you know, knuckles and other, you know, not unsuperior, just not as friendly, especially when they're older. Um, they don't run as well and everything. So um, combination of better stuff and better uh, products and uh, it's been pretty flawless. Both of the uh, two main lines are, they're not glued down yet, but the, the yard lead and everything here is. Got to finish up gluing down these. Got to leave this section open though for the third main line and when the expansion comes back, but everything else you'll see pretty much sits as is and then we'll work in the, uh, the outer third line um, over time. But just so you can kind of see, get a little, you know, and then you're moving into the, you know, behind the mine scene. We're gonna, you know, obviously fill in the valley. Got the nice wooden portals here. Uh, that's a good shot. And then you know you're in the the mining valley zone and then uh you know you got your track up here on top of the hill to, you know once it's all detailed it'll be easier to see but there's a uh, another good shot so and then like i said um let me see if i can pull out some units here uh for like the pond got these woodland scenics little fly fishermen a bit pricey um bought those so those are gonna look nice you know in the little pond area and then i also got of the little John boat dock set up. So, like I said, gonna do the little, uh, you know, access road that services the mine. Do a little weed end that'll die over here near the pond. It's gonna be very wooded, but you know, there's gonna be the tiny dock, the John boat, and some buddies camping and fishing. And I didn't want the industry here. I felt with such a big industry scene over here, all the weeds and mine going on, I didn't, you know, I wanna leave it more lush. And then we're gonna do a little town ish, rural town scene with a refinery at one end. And a uh, wood mill, you know, right in town with a, probably just a small wood operation, two, three cars maybe. Um, so that's really kind of all I got. Um, been working on this little overpass log thing that's going to eventually go there on the lower line. Started sculpting there. Like I said, building up the falsetto. Did a lot of foam work too, just uh, little things, including the track work and everything else and uh, planned expansion. So um, I'll cut it short here. Just wanted to give you guys an update, show you we are working. Uh, comment, leave me comments, subscribe. If you want to see me just do some run buys or certain angles or how I'm doing things or tips or if you see I could be doing anything better, tips or tricks, you know, Tony Hawk, Ramelin, and Ding Dong, let me know. I'm going to try to make more frequent updates. It's just hard when I only do small things. It's been, you know, a couple months since I've been working on it, almost weekly again. So um, appreciate you guys and uh, the train may. I will be back soon. And it's almost train season, fall to winter, train season. So, random limiting though.